Cornell West bunny hopped. Nobody running for president is dedicated to the black family. I love Cornell West, good man. But he bunny hopped. Kamala Harris bunny hopped. Katanji Jack, bunny. Can we get some non bunny hopping candidates? I don't vote for bunny hoppers. Ricky Smiley said vote for Kamala so she can get sworn in as an AKA by Katanji, the Delta, and they both bunny hop. This is insane. This is insane. Identity politics, black fraternity and sorority politics. What about grassroots black ghetto politics? What about grassroots black ghetto politics? I keep hearing about sorority politics, black bourgeoisie politics, identity politics. What about grassroots black ghetto politics? Not a word about the prison system. You know how many black people they locking up unjustifiably in this country? Do you know America incarcerates more people than any country in the world? And those people are disproportionately our people and we're not supposed to ask no questions? America incarcerates the most people in the world, land of the free. Look at the hypocrisy. Look at the hip hop, land of the free, and you incarcerate most people, the most people in the world, disproportionately Africans, American Africans. And we can't ask about the prison reform initiative. I saw North Philly Meek Mill, shout out to Meek. I saw North Philly Meek Mill said he want to ask Kamala Harris three questions. North Philly's Meek Mill said he wants to ask Kamala Harris three questions. I'm going to hold you to that, Meek. I'm going to hold you to that, Ra Meek. Because my brother, if you prison reform man, we need to hear about you more when it comes to Trump and Kamala, good brother. You need to show up and show out, Meek Mill. If you're the prison reform person for hip hop, your voice need to be a little louder, my brother, because I don't really see you pushing the way you need to push on these two. Now, you, you still got some time, so I'm gonna be patient with you, young brother. You still got some time, so I'm gonna be patient with you, but my brother Meek, Meek Mill, we from the same hood, same block, 18th and Burks, you know who I am. You need to push a little harder, young brother. You need to push a little harder, young brother. You need to push a little harder. Okay, you can't link with me. I'm too radical for you. You can't link with me. But just make sure you push a little harder. That's all good, brother. Keep up the good fight. But I need you to step on that gas. Step on that gas a little bit. We got three months until November the 4th. I need you to step on that gas a little bit. Brothers and sisters. What is Kamala going to do about the special ed to prison pipeline? What is Donald Trump going to do about the special ed to prison pipeline? What are they going to do about all these racist teachers sabotaging the education of our sons? I ain't heard a word yet. Melanin drip, Leo season. Melanin is definitely dripping. Black gold all day. What are they gonna do about the school to prison pipeline? What are they gonna do about all these black children being tried as adults? What are they gonna do about this? What are they gonna do about the unpaid labor persecution and dehumanization of our African ancestors? What are they gonna do about that? What are they gonna do? You think we are gonna let you get away? without paying for the greatest 
the greatest human tragedy in world history and we just gonna forget because y'all gave us a vote and a flag ninja please ninja please ninja please you think we're gonna forget about 246 years of forced labor psychological rape cultural dehumanization and we gonna forget about it because you put LeBron in the Olympics we gonna forget about it because you let my beautiful sister Shikari run and you let Noah shout out to Noah Lyles with the beautiful African Jamaican queen shout out to my brother Noah Lyles with the beautiful Jamaican African queen oh yes he the first brother I saw with a chocolate goddess shout out to Noah Lyles Shout out to Noah Lyles for pulling up at the Olympics with a deep, dark, rich, melanated, beautiful Jamaican African sister. Oh, yes. We not playing diaspora wars around here. We won race. Pan-Africanism is back, but we never left. Oh, yes. Shout out to Noah Lyles for pulling up with the Jamaican African queen putting the diaspora wars to rest. We ain't fighting, we united around these parts. The African diaspora will be united. We will be united. I wanna give a shout out to my brother from Botswana who won the first gold medal in the history in the 200 meters. I'm proud of my brother. I can't wait to come to Botswana and build with my Botswana Africans. I can't wait to come to Botswana and build with my Botswana Africans. We are one people. We are one people. We are one people. Peace and Pan-Africanism, peace and Pan-Africanism. This is your big brother. We live in direct Costa Rica. We live in direct Costa Rica. I'm in the building. Where are my Central American Africans at? Black queens forever, snow bunnies never. Costa Rican queens forever, snow bunnies never. Panamanian African queens forever, snow bunnies never. Honduras African queens forever, snow bunnies never. RB Jesus is in the building. Costa Rica, I'm in the building. I'm going to take me a nice, a nice, Nature, I'm gonna take me a nice nature bath. With my Costa Rican, I'm gonna take me a nice Costa Rican bath out in mother nature and just <laughs> meditate. Get all the coon juices off me. Y'all feel me, family? King Kong, Costa Rica. King Kong, where my, where my Salvadorian Africans at? Where my Salvadorian, are y'all pulling up tomorrow in Limon province? Are y'all pulling up tomorrow in Limon province? Are you coming to be with the prince? Are you coming to be with the prince of Pan-Africanism? Central American Africans, I'm in the building. Bring your red, black, and green flags. I said, bring your red, black, and green flags. I'm in the city where Marcus Garvey invaded 120, excuse me, not 120, 114 years ago. Garvey came to Costa Rica in 1910. Dr. Umar took over the conscious movement in 2010. Marcus Garvey landed in Costa Rica in 1910. And the Prince of Pan-Africanism took over the Pan-African movement in 2010. So that's 114 years ago that Marcus Garvey came to Costa Rica and began to study the problems of Africans in the diaspora, brothers and sisters. Mr. Garvey studied the problems. Starting in Costa Rica, he would go to Panama, he would go around Central South America, he would go to London, back to Jamaica, started the greatest of associations, and then came to New York City, and the rest was history. And then the rest was history. Oh yes. Oh yes, I'm not wasting no time. We got to organize the diaspora 
And then we're going to step to Africa after we organize the diaspora. I said, we're going to step to Africa after we organize the diaspora. I said, we're going to step to Africa after we organize the diaspora. I said, we're going to step to Africa after we organize the diaspora. Oh, yes. Oh, yes. We're my Costa Rican queens with the deep tissue massage. We're my Costa Rican African queens with the deep tissue massage. We're my Salvadorian, my, where my Honduras African queens at? We're my silverback gorilla alpha males of Central America. We're my silverback gorilla alpha males. Oh, yes. Don't call me white girl podcast. Why you say that? They supposed to be reaching out to me? Don't call me a white girl podcast. I'm not familiar. I don't think I've gotten an invitation from them yet. Silverback gorilla. Where my under 30 year old Central American Africans at? I'm focusing on the under 30s. I'm focusing on the under 30s. We got to organize the under 30s. Tomorrow, Culture House, Limon Province on the Caribbean coast of Costa Rica, four o'clock. I want to see all my Central American Africans. I want to see all my Central American Africans. My Guatemalan Africans. Honduras Africans. Panamanian Africans. Where my Nicaraguan Africans at? Where my Nicaraguan Africans at? Where my Nicaraguan at? Where my El Salvadorian Africans at? Where my Belizean Africans at? I look chubby. Why are you looking at my body, my ninja? Why are you looking at my body, family? Here we go again. We need them testosterone shots. You looking at my body, talking about I look chubby. Listen, family. Where your queen at? Let's see if she say I'm chubby. Where your queen at, my ninja? Beta male. Where you go, beta male? Calling another man chubby. It just don't. Why are you looking at my? What's wrong with you, my brother? You need some testosterone tablets? Where your queen at? Let's see if she call me chubby. Where your queen at, my ninja? Costa Rica. I'm in the building. I better see my Belizean Africans tomorrow. I better see my Honduras Africans, my Nicaraguan Africans, my Panamanian Africans, my El Salvadorian Africans, my Guatemalan Africans. I'm taking over Central America. I'm taking over Central America. I'm taking over Central America. to Viejo 5 o'clock at the Liberty Hall brothers and sisters I'm going to take me a nice bath a nice buttermilk a nice buttermilk bath oh yes Outside, I never had a bathtub in the nature. We're going to do it tonight. Oh, yes. You want to get in the tub with me, my beautiful African sister? We can't. You want to get in the tub? You want to bathe with the prince? Let's do it coming to America style. I need two queens to bathe the prince. Let's do it coming to America style. Let's do it coming to America style. Let's do it coming to America style. I need two Central American African queens. Extra five, extra curvy, five, five, thick in the th all natural hair. I need to be bathed. 
All natural hair, I need to be big. Where my Central American African queens at? Have your cell phones because we're taking pictures tomorrow. I want to show all my beautiful Central American African queens all over my social media like I did with my beautiful London African queens. Shout out to my United Kingdom family who showed up and showed out Sunday night. Shout out to my UK, Black Britain, London African family that came out 